the Speaks Reading Buddies program is a 10 session program where kids learn vocabulary with the help of Martha, who is a talking dog. Instead of the alphabet soup that she eats going to her stomach, it goes to her brain and gives her a very robust vocabulary. The words that Martha Speaks Reading Buddies teaches, they're called tier two words. So they're a little more challenging than words you find in your everyday vocabulary. And these are the words that when you encounter them in reading can often cause fluency problems. They have to figure out how to sound out the word and then they don't know what the word means. So the more vocabulary that we can enrich our kids knowledge with, the easier it will be when they become readers. We've gone back and there's a few that gave us sentences or they were able to say, oh, I saw that in Martha, and that's when Martha, and it's, it's amazing, and some of their explanations for these words are better than I could come up with. Partnerships like this one with Vegas PBS and Anson are vital to keeping our community strong and educated. To be successful in life, reading is the key factor. You, uh, if a child is able to, to maintain their grade level, their reading level from an early age, then um, they will succeed in life and they'll take that with them. During the summer, we were able to deliver the Martha Speaks program to over 500 students at 10 locations across the valley. We provided the staff to deliver the programs to all these kids, so with that partnership, we were able to get it to a lot larger number of children than, than they would have been able to deliver it to. Forbidden. Oh, it means you're like forbidden to go there. You're not supposed to. It's illegal to go there. Against the rules, exactly. <laughs> The summer reading program is almost coming to an end and I have the privilege of going to the ice cream parties which we give the kids and you at the, those ice cream parties you get to hear them say the words and, and to deliver the meaning of the words and it is remarkable to see six-year-olds that uh, know the word of obedient and disobedient and encouragement and uh, so you know to me that that is very rewarding because I don't believe that if we did not provide that program to those 500 plus kids that most of them would have heard those words over summer. We've leaped over the, the past three years and um, the 2013 school year closed with about 800 students in our academic homework help and tutoring program. We'll start the 2014 school year with over 1,200 students, so we have a long road ahead of us. Our vision at Anson is to instill a lifelong love of learning with students because I believe that if we're able to teach students the habit of learning and teach students the importance of education, they will be able to, to take that with them. Anson partners with other nonprofit organizations across the valley because collectively we can deliver programs to a much larger number of students. This summer we partner with the Boys and Girls Clubs. We delivered the summer reading program at seven of their locations plus the St. Anne's Catholic School where they run a summer program and St. Jude's Ranch in Boulder City as well as the YMCA. Uh, recently we've learned about summer learning loss meaning that children that get out of school in the spring and summer and come to us if they don't work on academics over the summer they, they tend to start to fall behind where they were when they left school. One of the important uh, things that Anson brings to the Y is the, the curriculum related to reading and spending time with instructors with, uh, with the children, helping them read throughout the course of the summer because many of the folks that we hire are great camp counselors, they're great with kids to do um, active type things, but they're not folks that are well skilled or well versed in, uh, in the reading aspect. So this is really a good partnership for, uh, for us. It takes everybody to uh, really make a, a huge impact on the kids. The YMCA's relationship with Anson is really important, in particular with those kids that are in some of the underserved areas, some of the kids that are really struggling um, at home financially. If you think about a child who gets out of school uh, in the summer and doesn't have an opportunity to read a book, doesn't have an iPad, doesn't have an iPhone, doesn't have some of the opportunities that maybe some of the suburban kids might have, it's really important to get them here to the Y. Um, partner them up with Anson, with the, with the curriculum that they have, with the instructors that they have, and, and really bless their achievement that they have over the course of the summer. And giving them an opportunity that normally they, they certainly just wouldn't have.